Burning Man is underway and thousands of burners are headed to the Black Rock Desert to set up their campsites today. Jamie Hayes is live in the studio. She spoke to a local business about how they're working with burners to keep the playa clean. Jamie? Yeah, as you mentioned before, thousands of people from all over the country and even the world are headed down to Burning Man and with that is all their camping gear and of course bikes. One group is not only allowing burners to rent their gear, but also accepting donations after so all that gear doesn't end up in the trash or left at the playa. Take your camping gear, your food, and we distribute it through all the food banks and shelters uh, around the surrounding communities. One of the main burner necessities is a bike. I got a bike. I got all that fun stuff. Yep, so we rented some bikes. But unfortunately, some of those bikes get left behind. BM Bike Rentals hopes to change that. Our endeavor is to have 10,000 bikes eventually and have people just pick them up from us and drop them back off. We can reuse them, we can fix them up throughout the year and uh, it eliminates a lot, of, a lot of waste, which is kind of what this event's about. And not only is getting all the gear you need a challenge, but getting up to the playa is also difficult due to traffic. But burners say getting there early can help. Coming early, getting here ahead of time, uh, having everything you think you might possibly need. And if you do hit traffic, make sure you have something to keep you busy. We bought a pigskin, so if we get stuck in the line, then we can throw that to each other for a while. That's our game plan. And while some people decide to take their own cars up to Burning Man, others decide to take the bus. This skips the line both ways, and it's more environmentally friendly, so I felt like it's probably the best way to do it. And you can donate all your bikes and, and your non-perishable food and your camping gear at the end of Burning Man to BM Bikes. They are right off the freeway when you get to Wadsworth. And they still have plenty of bikes to rent out. Covering the story, Jamie Hayes, Channel 2 News.